Louis Mel, the descendant of a French nobleman who made a fortune in beet sugar during the Napoleonic Wars, created films that explored life and its meaning. Mel's family discouraged his early interest in film but, in 1950, allowed him to enter the Institute of Advanced Cinematographic Studies in Paris. His resume showed that he had worked as an assistant to filmmaker Robert Bresson when Mal was hired by underwater explorer Jacques-Yves Cousteau to be a camera operator on the Calypso. Cousteau soon promoted him to be co-director of The Silent World, 1956, The Silent World. Years later, Cousteau called Mal the best underwater cameraman he ever had. Mal's third film, The Lovers, 1958. The Lovers starring Jean Moreau broke taboos against on-screen eroticism. In 1968 the U.S. Supreme Court reversed the obscenity conviction of an Ohio theater that had exhibited Les Amon. A director during the Nouvelle Vague, New Wave, of 1950s and 1960s, though technically not considered a Nouvelle Vague auteur, he also made films on the other side of the Atlantic, starting with Pretty Baby, 1978 the film that made Brooke Shields an international superstar. The actress who played a supporting role in that film was given a starring role in Mal's next American film, Atlantic City, 1980. That promising actress was Susan Sarandon. In one of his later French films, Au Revoir Les Enfants, 1987, Mal was able to find catharsis for an experience that had haunted him since the German occupation of France in World War II. At age 12, he was sent to a Catholic boarding school near Paris that was a refuge for several Jewish students, one of them was Mal's rival for academic honors and his friend. A kitchen worker at the school with a grudge became an informant. The priest who was the principal was arrested and the Jewish students were sent off to concentration camps. In his final film, Vanya on 42nd Street, 1994, Mal again penetrated the veil between life and art as theater people rehearse Anton Chekhov's Uncle Vanya. In that film, Mal worked again with theater director Andre Gregory and actor playwright Wallace Shawn, The Conversationalists of My Dinner with Andre, 1981. Mal was married to Candace Bergen, and he succumbed to lymphoma in 1995.